Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. How you guys doing? How you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing well because I'm doing well for you guys. I hope you guys are doing well too. Okay? My name is Chica. I'm a YouTuber based in Vegas, Nigeria. I make beautiful videos for you guys to watch and enjoy what the fuss is all about. Watch and enjoy. I make beauty, um, videos on beauty, fashion, lifestyle. And today's video is going to be about fashion. Women, fashion, tips. If you ever see that from the title and the middle, women, fashion, tips. Guys. And if you want to hear, I'll listen to this tape, so keep on watching. Okay guys, we're back. As obviously, I told you guys that this year I'm going to get this for me. The whole glowing, glowing up series I'm here for you. So I'm here to help you mentally, physically, and then you own that. So when we talk about glow, I mean the physical glow and even your own glow. And today's glow is get about the physical because we're talking about fashion. So when it comes to dressing and all that, it's I mean a lot of people find it easy. They can style themselves, they know what to wear. Lots of people are still trying to find their style. Oh, maybe some people have found their style, but maybe you just want to change one or two things and all. You know, you just want to keep getting better by the day. So, yeah, this video is meant for everybody. So, listen and share. Okay? Alright, so, um, today I'm going to talk about fashion tips for women. Fashion tips for women. Certain things that you can do to just make sure that you're always in check. You look nice. You walk nice. You appear nice and all that. So, yeah. So, number one is... Always wear a seamless new bra. Please have that, have that more in your wardrobe or your closet, more than you have any colorful or lace bra or any of that because this will go a long way for you. This is gonna, this goes with any and every outfit. Compared to when you have a lace bra, you can only wear with specific outfits. Do you understand what I'm saying? So wear a seamless or a seamless or new bra. This will go with any color of outfit, any type of outfit. It will match everything. So, <clears throat> You know when you dress up, you wear some clothes or some top, like surely when you wear white top and I used to think that when you wear white top, I wear a black bra, it's not going to show, but I've noticed that sometimes it still show depending, surely when what you're wearing is really, really, if the top is really, really sheer, like really, really transparent and light, your black bra will show, but a new bra or a bra close to your skin color will not do that, so invest in that, that's really important, if one is similar to so, so that it's not just about the bra showing, but you know, having the line, like when you wear the product, you see the line of the bra. You might not see the color of the bra, but you will see the line. So, so not just about the color showing, but like, you don't want the bra protruding out. Like when someone sees you, they can see the line of your bra and stuff like that. You know? So, you want to get something, the pants and the bra close to your skin color so that you're not showing any pant lines, any color pants. Any bra lines and any color of bra, okay? Because once you do that, you're not going to be looking sophisticated in the bra, okay? So we don't want that, okay? Okay. <laughs> so that's number one. Number two, we have always look at yourself in front of the mirror before leaving the house. Always look at yourself in front of the mirror at every angle before leaving the house. So you don't just want to look at the front and see how the front looks. You want to look at the back. You want to check out the sides, okay, the right side, the left side, to see if you have anything sticking out, maybe like thread is just hanging somewhere, or you look at the back of your hair, and the whole hair strand is just flying out in the So you want to look at from different angles to make sure that you're in check in every corner, okay? So turn around, look at the front, look at the sides, check in the back, okay? So that you make sure everything is in place, okay? Thank you. Okay, tip number three find your style. I have a video on my channel talking about how to find your style. So please check that out. I'll leave it here in the description box and here to check it out. So number three, find your style. Always go for something comfy and something for your body type. Okay. This will help you look better and there'll be no hassle when it comes to dressing. And honestly when you put out clothes to wear, you'll see that you always look nice in what you're wearing because you're wearing something for your body type. And also another thing you should do is try and always Figure out everything what you want to wear for the week, especially if you work or you know, I mean, like you have a nice time or something, maybe go out every day. Make sure you've lined out all you're going to be wearing for the week. This makes you uh, save you time and that way you're always ready. Okay, tip number four always add a pop of color to your outfit. So let's say you're doing everything you need 
or you're wearing like all white. Honestly, me, I'm one person that I like when it comes to I love pairing like black and red, black and white together. Like if I'm wearing all black or maybe all white, I will just throw in the red bag or red lipstick. Like, and you can't see me all nudie. I don't know why, but for some reason, you would see me all nudie. So let's ask you. Uh, Okay, so if I'm wearing me myself, I love wearing my mouth, so you would always catch me on the red lipstick. Like, if I don't do my makeup, I'll just cover it up by putting on my glasses and put on the red lipstick. You would think that hey, I did your bang, bamming makeup like this, but no, it's just red lipstick, or just a pop of color. So, a pop of color to your outfit, like, you know, make your piece stand out and make you look cheeky. And you just not doing all maybe you wear all white with a white shirt and a white bag. You know, Add something that would pop, okay. A pop of color just always elevates the outfit, okay. Number five for the women fashion tips take care of your belongings, take care of your shoes. If you pay attention to you, take care of them, take, take care of your shoes, your bags, your sneakers, your slippers. Here, and almost all the time, you just wear and you're off the door. Mm -mm, guys, let's try to not do that. Even our bags, you can carry one bag for one week without even change it to another bag or anything, you just keep carrying the same bag and you're not even taking care of it. See, it's your bag, you need to clean it, yes, you clean your bag. Just take a napkin, wipe down your bag and you can do, um, you, cannot, this also, you can also do this by adding, if you have like a sheen, something you can spray on the bag to just give it a bit of a shine. But what you can do is just apply plastic on your hand, put it all over the bag after you've cleaned them, then just use a napkin to apply it to you know just make it shine and look look better and look more alive you know clean these things even your shoes your slippers me yeah, i'm guilty of my slippers is by the door once i'm going to just put on my slippers and i'm off that's what i do but to clean it mm -mm, but i'll try outside with that but my shoes i clean before i wear but my you see my slippers that slippers are so far you don't clean my slippers so let's try to do these things clean your slippers your sneakers, when you want to wear it, wash it, especially the white parts. Please wash it because that brown, that white part, keep brown, it doesn't look nice at all. I always do this because <clears throat> I have two boys, I always wash their own sneakers, so that makes me wash mine too. So please wash your sneakers, keep them, keep maintain them so they will last long for you and they will look nice when you wear them. Okay? Okay, okay. So tip number six have your go to outfit for those days when nothing else looks so good and honestly <clears throat> there are days like that that you wear you dress up or you just don't even wear like you don't know what you might be wearing might be good and might be nice but so you for some reason you just don't look good you're not feeling yourself and same thing with makeup there are days when you do your makeup and ugh, you know as in you've not even started the makeup but you're already glowing you're already looking nice but <clears throat> there's some days that you be doing your makeup and you ask yourself, what are you doing? Like, what is happening? Why is it coming out like this? Why is it like you just look somehow? So there are days like that. So have outfits because that's why I said find your style and know your body type. Once you find your style and know your body type, you already have clothes and you already know that on a normal day, no matter what, when I wear this, it always looks good on me. So whatever I'm doing now is not the plot. It's just me. Okay, so. Have those outfits ready so that on those days when you're trying to wear something else and it's not looking nice, you just go and grab your go to you know that no matter what, I will look nice on this. People will compliment me when I wear this because I know this is me. Do you understand? So always have that go to outfit on those days when nothing looks nice. You can just grab it and you're off the door. Okay? Tip number seven accessories, accessories, accessories. Me, I love accessorizing. And um, accessories has to also do with your uh, undertone, your skin tone. Some people are warm undertone, like neutral undertone, all those things. And gold might fit you more than silver when it you. See me, I love gold accessories. I'm not a fan of silver. I only wear silver when it's necessary. Like, I, I need to wear silver on this outfit. Like, it's just silver that will go on this outfit. That's where I bring out silver research. But if you check my accessories collection, it is gold. I have more gold than I have silver, so it's always gold for me. But you know, find out what some people silver. I mean, gold and silver works well on me, but I just love silver. I mean, I just love gold more. 
So, you know, understand your undertone so that you know what accessory fits you best. And a little accessory, just a little bit of accessory can elevate your look. It looks like really, really simple. But by the time we accessorize, it just brings in everything together. So, always accessorize accordingly. You know what to use, what kind of earrings, necklaces. So, just a little bit here and there, and you look good, and that's um, your outfit is elevated. So, accessorize accordingly, okay? Tip number eight, always iron your clothes. Please, don't come out with rumpled clothes. Always iron your clothes. You can iron all your clothes for the week so that you don't always have to iron when you're ready to go out. No, iron maybe a day before or no, what am I wearing for the week? What am I going to wear? Monday to Saturday, Monday to Sunday. Monday to Sunday, Monday to Iron it on one day and then just put your clothes and go off. That saves you time because number one, the clothes are iron, number two, you already know what to wear. So, I mean, it's actually here in Nigeria. Once you see lights, we call iron. Actually, if maybe you don't, you're not even in an apartment where you're using, um, maybe you're not living in a service apartment or you don't have a list of later, you sort of, once you see like we go pack all your clothes, go iron it, arrange them, you know that you want. Because never can disappoint you. They can be forming braiding lights every day now for the, uh, the the next two weeks, and then all of a sudden, they just disappear. We don't see them for two days, like blackout for two days and then you're like oh my gosh what am i going to do what am i going to do that's happened to me several times like okay i'm like i never always bring it like at this time now so i'll just iron my other time when that time comes out like, you won't see any like okay so please always iron your clothes whenever you see it okay even if you're in a country where you have to go out electricity try and iron your clothes for the week this just helps you to stay more organized and that way you're always ready simple okay okay so tip number nine, buy clothes that you wear often. Buy your regular clothes other than fancy clothes. I've said this before. Don't go and be buying clothes. Don't buy clothes based on oh this dress is nice. Then you buy it for the kid. Oh this dress should be nice to wear for everybody. Meanwhile, you don't have any money coming up in the next six months. That clothes is just sitting down there, doing nothing, occupying space. And then clothes that you wear every day, you don't have. So please buy regular clothes your regular clothes more than you buy fancy clothes is that understood most of us will see oh you just want this level. oh i like this dress this dress is really nice then just keep it it's good to wear for your wedding you know it's good to go for wear for one occasion or this or that you know that occasion in the next one year you're not going to know but when it's time to maybe visit a friend you just throw up or go see a movie you're looking for nine jeans and talk to me you don't have you just have dresses 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 that you can't wear anyway so do you understand to buy more of your regular clothes so that way you always have different styles of your regular clothes and you don't find yourself repeating the same thing all the time okay okay number 10 of my fashion tips take care of your skin nails and hair i know we all focus on clothes shoes perhaps things that for your skin okay it's equally important your skin your hair Almost all these come together to make an outfit look nice. So if your hair is looking anyhow, your outfit's gonna look anyhow. If your skin is just anyhow, too, your outfit. So take care of all these things, not just to yeah for your overall look and for your mental health. So because doing some of these things just helps you to relax. I know when you're relaxed, you're seeing clearly, you understand things more, you're able to visualize a lot of things. You're not clouded with negativity, anger, you know, all those things you're in the free world, you, your, your, your mind is free. So yeah, please do all these things to help relax yourself and just give you an overall look, both physically and from inside. Okay? Okay. <laughs> so, side note before I end, notes that we are growing every day, so it's okay for your style to change. Your style is not going to remain one particular style for the rest of your life. We're growing, everything is changing as we grow. So our style too will change as we grow. It's okay to say, okay, I used to roll a dress like this before, but I roll up on the fixed days. Or you know, you just see yourself slight, slightly gravitating towards something else. It's okay. It's you, you're growing. So things are changing, your style is changing. So your style is gonna change and enhance as you grow and enhance. So your body is stuck anyway, you're allowed to change whenever you want to. So yeah. As I hope this tip helps you. I hope it makes you well. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Tell me what videos you want to see next. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Love you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.